Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, I'm going to talk about one of the best, if not the best, PDF editor for Windows 11. In this video, we're going to talk about Wondershare PDF Element. Wondershare PDF Element is a free piece of software that you can use to edit and manage your PDF documents. You're going to have their link down below in the description and from there you can download the free version to try it for free. In this video, we're going to go through some of the most important features and I'm going to show you how to use the software. Once you open the software, it will look something like this. You have a main screen where you have some buttons. You have the button to open files, basically some PDF files. You have compare PDF, combine PDF, compress PDF, OCR PDF, convert PDF, create PDF, and batch PDF. Let's open a PDF file by clicking on open files and selecting our PDF document. And after we add our PDF document, you're going to see that we have a whole bunch of tools that we can use. Starting from up here, we have highlight. Of course, we also have the option to do a signature and a whole bunch of other stuff in the comment section. We also have the edit section where we can add a text. So just click on add text and for example, type in here something. If you select the text, of course, you're going to be able to select its font, the font font size and other things that you can apply to the text. You also can add an image. You can attach a link, a watermark, a background, a head or a footer, page number. Basically, you don't have any limitations when you're trying to edit a PDF document. Of course, you can edit existing text in a PDF document and you can move it around. It's basically very easy to use. So for example, if you want to delete a text, simply select it and then delete it. We also have the convert section where we can convert our PDF document to Word, Excel, PPT, image, text, or other formats. We also have some tools, for example, we can compare two PDF documents. Maybe we have two PDF documents that we want to compare. We can use this tool. We also have combined files. Basically, we can combine multiple PDF tools into one. We have OCR, OCR area, compressed PDF, flatten file, crop, watermark, capture, and so on. And we also have some other features, for example, view, form, protect. We can set a password for our PDF document. That is really cool. In the page section, we can arrange our PDF pages. We can maybe switch to pages between one another. That's really cool. And another cool thing, if you click on template, you're going to have some cool templates provided by Wondershare PDF element that you can use for your PDF documents. That is really, really cool. So for example, you have resumes, you have cards, you have letters, you have invitations, planners, invoices, and so on and so forth. This is really, really cool in my opinion. And uh, this is basically a well-rounded software. You, you can do a whole bunch of stuff using this software. So now just for some testing purposes, let's do some edits to our PDF document and then save it on our desktop. So I'm just gonna go to edit and I'm gonna click on add image. We're gonna add an image to our PDF document. As you can see, we can drag and drop our image wherever we want. We can resize it. You can easily resize it and move it where you want in this PDF document. And let's also add a text Text, for example, YouTube channel, and we are going to add a link. Click on the link tool and then open a web page. Select the text or the area where you want that link to be applied, and then paste in here the web link. For example, I've entered my YouTube channel and then click on OK. And for testing purposes, you can switch on to the read mode in order for you to be able to test if this is working properly. Click on the link and then click on yes, and that link should open up with the default browser. For example, let's convert our PDF document to an image. I'm going to save the change and then I'm going to select desktop and it's going to convert our PDF document into a .jpg file. That's really cool. Just wait for the conversion process. After the conversion has been completed, we can open to see the file. We have the file here. As you can see, it was converted into a .jpg file. Another cool thing about this software is that you can use it as a PDF viewer. As you can see, I have a test PDF file here. Automatically, when you install the software, PDF files will be assigned to Wondershare PDF elements. So when you double click on a PDF document, you can select to open it with Wondershare PDF element. And you can open it here and uh, read it and also edit, convert and so on and so forth 
whatever you want to do with the PDF file. So in my opinion, Wondershare PDF Element is one of the best, if not the best, free PDF editors that you can use in Windows 11. And of course, I strongly recommend you try this software. Go into the links down below in the description and download the free version and try for yourself and see if the software will be useful to you. This was Wondershare PDF Element. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBased. Until next time, have a nice day.